I can't remember the last time I slept for 12 hours. Have you ever slept for 12 hours? I used to a lot when I was a kid. I wanted to, I was never allowed to. <laughs> Here I am drinking soda for breakfast. See? Proof right there. You can drink soda for breakfast and be just fine. I'm kind of kind of wasteful right now, but starting to slow me down. I'm kind of well set up. I mean, I have everything I need. Even some things I don't need. Like five sewing kits. <laughs> Let's go ahead and break that down. We don't need that. There. Better shape. Only carrying around 85 pounds of stuff. I'm sure that's fine. <laughs> How much cloth am I carrying? Yeah. I think I, uh, probably stand to lose some things. 12 pounds. 20, 20 pounds of clothes. That is a lot. Stuff's heavy. Alright, I'm gonna try to find my, my cabin I was staying in, because I got some stuff in there I need. And then we'll just go to a different place. I don't know. Whatever's next to the coastal highway. Gonna stay on the move. Oh, it's nice and windy. I always love it when it's windy in this game. Let's see, and I think... I am. Not in real life. I'm not. We're not moving in real life. Unless so I find another snake. This stuff's really useful. If you're... You know, you don't have antibiotics, but, I mean... Not antibiotics, the, uh, antiseptic. If you don't have antiseptic, this stuff is really useful. But I'm carrying around, like, five bottles of antiseptic. So I guess it's kind of pointless to kick, take all this. I don't know. Oh, that's water. I should probably not go in the water. Walking against the wind. What's your problem? You tired already? I mean, it's 19 degrees out. That's not cold. Come on. Jon Snow? Oh, he is a crow. He's not like a crow, like... That kind of crow. Different kind of crow. Crow man. I think I've already been over here, but <gasps> yes. Just what I need. Who just leaves that in a fishing hut? Ow. All right, I got a gun. Feels like a lot of gear. Loading stripper clips into a gun like that is not as easy as they just made it look. I mean, I guess it, you know, be kind of boring to watch yourself like fumble around with a stripper clip as you're trying to put bullets into your mag or into your uh, rifle. But I've done it before, and it's not that easy if you've never done it before. <laughs> he gets he. The Ambigamer says, and he knows nothing, apparently. And Jon Snow definitely knows nothing, as he's repeatedly told. Alright, so I'm back at the cabin that I wanted to go to. Then I found the other cabin over there. So in Coastal Highway, there's two cabins, apparently. And then all the ones off in that direction, too. So I know there's an achievement. An achievement? Sweet. So I have, I have a rifle. She wanted me to kill a bear. So I think, I think I'm going to try to kill a bear. See how this goes. Let's go back in here. and Ditch everything. So in case the bear attacks me, I have somewhere I can run to. I don't imagine the bear is going to be very happy that I'm shooting at it. I mean, one of these days, I'm actually going to kill a bear in this game. It will be a glorious day. And then I'll simultaneously feel bad because I killed a bear. But, it'll have to happen eventually, because... I have to learn how to deal with these things, because they're kind of... Bears are messed up. They'll... 
They're really not that friendly in the long dark. And I didn't do anything to them. Except shoot at them. I guess I kind of did. That leaves me light enough to where I can run away if I need to. I can't believe I left the microwave door open. Alright, I'm gonna go kill a bear now. Oh, uh, Jennifer's playing uh, Destiny 2. She's gonna buy me a copy for her birthday. I'm not sure how that works. Alright. Why did you crouch? I didn't want you to crouch. Let's go find a bear. I know there's one around here somewhere. I've seen him. Like I'm in the great outdoors. I mean, obviously this is the great outdoors. I mean the movie with John Candy in it. Big bear. The bald... Was it the bald head? It had a bald head. Giant bear. It hacked people. cave? Okay, so there's a cave. Might be the bear's cave. There's a dead guy. Not the bear's dead guy. I'll keep that in mind. He's keeping me informed. All these cool people are showing up to watch me Try and not die. This is great. I am kind of bummed out. I don't see the bear anywhere nearby. There's a wolf over there. Break a leg trying to get down from here. Nope. Okay. I know there's a bear. I know I sound obsessive over that, but... I am determined. I've shot at three bears, and I've killed zero. Of course of me playing this game. And I'm not a terrible shot. I've hit the bear. I've watched the blood go poof. But blood goes poof. It's called the pink mist, actually. Yes, that is the sound it makes, too. She's making fun of me. That's always a good sign. Those people bones? What if I just wait here, he'll come for me. I'm looking for trouble. <laughs> Get a meat necklace? I could... You know, I was thinking about using like some sort of... Like, when, you're, when you're hunting bucks, you... Cover yourself in dough urine. It just sounds awful. Always smells awful. But it would work, wouldn't it? I mean, I don't have any bear urine, but... Not that I would really want to smear myself in bear urine. Oh yeah, you haven't played since it was first on Steam? Like back when it was in early access? A lot has changed. Look, you can see his hands. I'll have you know... I don't have good luck with bears. I leave them alone and they come after me. I have a score to settle. Now that I'm actually looking for them, I can't find them. And I want to be left alone, they don't leave me alone. When they want to be left alone, I can't find them. Not fair. Games should be fair. Oh, well, okay, I found it. Hi. <laughs> Where did he come from? Uh, permadeath was not actually added. It was always a thing. Which you guys will likely see here in a second, because if you look over in that direction, right about there, there's a bear. So... Strategize. I made that post about using guerrilla tactics. Let's talk about bear tactics. Bear tactics. This is bear tastic. You know a bear es expert? Who? I don't think I can really call on Dwight Street right now. 
or Mr. Poop as he's so affectionately called. I don't know. I ha I don't know if I have it in me to do this right now. Don't make eye contact. Back away slowly. He's not making eye contact with me, or she. I feel like I'm gonna miss if I fire. All right. So the key to shooting, if you haven't fired a firearm before, is that you don't fire when you're breathing. You wait for your breath, you hold it, and you fire. But you also have to, if you really want to get technical with it, you can fire between your heartbeats, which is really hard to do, and most people don't actually do that. Um, so you see the scope, or the uh, iron sights are kind of moving right now. So you have to wait for it to be lined up properly, otherwise you will miss. So I'm going to Go ahead and get this kind of lined up. See if I. <laughs> it didn't even phase him. <laughs> uh. All right. <laughs> Reload. I totally missed. Uh. Hey, I understand that he's going to be dinner, not me. I have a... You know what? Here's a tactic. Take the high ground. That's what I'm going to do. We're going to take the high ground. Alright, so we're we're taking bets now. We're going to take bets on... Who, who, thinks, who thinks that if... If I shoot that bear, that I'm going to be the winner. That I'm going to be the victor. You let me know. I don't think... I, don't, I might be able to take a poll. I don't know how that works in here. But you let me know what you think. And we'll see who's correct. Because I'm going to go ahead and say that I'm going to probably win. See? He's already... He knows what's going on. He's coming right at me. All right. Here we go. <laughs> this is not good. <laughs> 